From the project view in the TIA Portal project, expand the HMI element listing and double click the text and graphic list listing. In the text and graphic list working window, select the graphics tab. Name the new graphics list. and define the selection criteria, a bit for this example. Now we will define the graphic to be associated with the bit values. Start by defining the graphic for the bit value of 0. Drag and drop the desired graphic into the row. Now define the graphic for the bit value of 1. With the graphic list completed, it can be used on your HMI screens. Expand the screens listing and double click the desired screen to open. Drag and drop a graphic I.O. field onto the screen. With the graphic I.O. field highlighted, click the Properties tab. And define the process tag to be associated with the graphics field. Choose the function of the box, output in this example. And choose the graphics list to be displayed. The graphic appears on the screen. Resize as needed. The configuration is complete and can be tested. Highlight the HMI element in the project tree and click the simulation icon in the main menu bar. The Somatic WinCC Runtime Advanced window opens. Switch to the screen with the new graphic field and note that the new graphic is present. We will switch to the control screen to change the state of the bit associated with this graphic. The graphic changes to the run state. If the configuration is acceptable, save the project.